Um, we know, for example, and I want you all to put like what your emotions are when you've gone through this process, either yourself, with your child, or if you are a young adult who's on the line, just type into the chat some of the emotions that you've gone through and some of the things you felt. What we do know of African Americans, and I, and I think a lot of students of color, is that they really rely on their college counselors. So for those of you who are out there um, who are college counselors, um, please know that you are ground zero and your words matter, right? So please take care because you are impacting the emotions and maybe even a trajectory of a child. So when I do this talk, normally I talk about uh, racial anxiety. So this is one of the things where I feel like the college counseling and the parents kind of diverge, right? Because a lot of the parents of color are not happy. They don't feel like their kid has the right list. They feel like, you know, that it's assumed that their child is a low performer. Um, they're discouraged from applying to certain schools. I mean, so there are a lot of things that are going on and what, how the parents are perceiving the actions of college counselors. Um, so um, also what I see a lot in my work is that there is no thought about where a child of color might thrive, right? Not survive, I'm going back to that Kia and come on in. And not, not, I don't want my kids to survive. You don't want our kids to survive. You want them to thrive. So, you know, if you know about a kid, like I'll just use my own son for an example. He is very into wedded to his culture, right? I mean, and you know, I'll just use the slang. He's blackity black. I mean, he really is into his culture. So he, you know, to send him to Carlton College in Minnesota or to send him to Utah, it, he just wouldn't thrive there. He has to be in an urban center. So next slide. So one of the things that we see in college counseling is just really discounting the historically black colleges and universities. Um, and you all should know that they generate a lot of professional black people historically and even to this day. In fact, applications are at an all time high in part due to the racial climate in the country right now. So, and then there's no acknowledgement because we're so uncomfortable talking about race we don't talk about how, you know, a, a child might actually have a slightly better chance because the class of uh, the school is trying to make a class made up of all, all races and ethnicities. So we don't, one of the other things the adults don't do is, is, is say not just where they might not have a great chance, but where they might have a great chance. I often get, because of my other bandwagon is, 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 is a, a decreased debt, is that no, is a lot of times kids get lists that are full price lists. And, you know, that is, I mean, I just want to throw out there that a lot of times with race, when race is involved, there might be economic factors, not all the time, but sometimes there might be um, economic factors. And so that the list should be comprised of and should include things that take into account lessening the debt load. By the same token, we should not assume that everybody that is of color is on financial aid because that's a full pay parent. I'm just gonna throw that out there. Uh, so, and also the last thing that, uh, that college counselors and adults and their parents should be aware of are that there are a lot of programs out there. And I think we will provide, you know, maybe a few examples at the end of programs or I'll put in the chat, programs that really help students of color um, have a leg up like the LEAD program. Uh, there's, and, you know, the minority introduction to engineering programs that are around the country. Just, just a couple of examples where these programs, if you go into it and going into your junior year or going into your senior year are gonna give you an advantage, especially, uh, you know, if you go into the profession where they offer the program.